Hi there everyone. This is just a very quick video to let you know about some new AOS frames that are going into early access right now and will be launching in the next month or two. The AOS 5 V5, the AOS 5R and the AOS 3.5 V5. Although this isn't a launch video, I can give you a quick rundown of the key features of these new frames. All of these new frames feature the patent pending AOS XL anti-vibration technology. These cutouts help prevent vibrations being generated at the motors from being transferred into your flight control stack and can offer up to a 50% reduction in the vibrations seen at the flight controller. All of the arm mounting screws are reinforced with steel press nuts and the stack screws also have press nuts so you don't need to worry about having a golden nut on the bottom of each of your stack screws to get really great vibration performance. The AOS 5 and 3.5 V5 come with a new 7000 series aluminium camera cage and this cage has replaceable camera mounting plates. Out of the box you'll be able to hard mount any 19mm FPV camera and soft mount the DJI 03 system with a silicon gummy and you'll have full ND filter support as well. If you have a 3D printer you can print these little mounts, STLs are available on Thingiverse that will allow you to mount any size camera you like within these camera cages. Both the 5 and the 5R support props up to 5.3 inches in diameter with the Gemfan 5236 pairing particularly well with the AOS Supernova 2207. The AOS 3.5 supports props up to 3.5 inches in diameter with something like the Gemfan 3525 or the HQ 3.5 by 2.5 being great choices. All of these new frames are designed to be very very easy and quick to build Everything just screws together and you'll have access to all of your mounting screws without disassembling any part of the frame. Both the AOS 3.5 and AOS 5 have no props in view with the O3 system on its widest possible settings. However, for the AOS 5, the long body design means that you are going to need a 200mm long coaxial cable for the camera. So bear that in mind. I hope you enjoyed that sneak peek. If you want to learn more, there are links to the early access down in the video description and I'm looking forward to answering any questions you may have down in the comments. That's all I have for you for today, so until next time, I wish you all very, very happy flying.